Hi guys, as promised, I'm gonna make a review of the hummock. So here it is. It has three main parts. The first part is the top cup, the switch with the switch on. It uses a 510 connector. This one. The switch is kind of big for me, but it's okay. Uh, I like it this way, and it is all it's welded in all sides here, 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 and here. All four sides. And this is the top cup and um, battery contact. And here is the body, which is the middle part. It is, it, I think it's been cut in two. And then this silver part is, is a tube that has been inserted inside. See? And the main switch. Very nice. You just have to put two together. And I'm gonna use two 16340 batteries for a 6 volts vaping. The only problem for me is the contact spring. It's kind of short. See how deep is the battery when the when two batteries are put together? It's, it's very deep. But even without tweaking it, you'll be able to use it. It makes a good contact, but you'll hear something that rattles inside. You can, it, it can be resolved by putting another spring on top or any metal conductor and just screw it tightly that's it and I'm gonna use a CE2R4 made by made and cut by Sir Mike and Kuya Pam thank you it's this long actually it doesn't it's not that heavy you know my indulgence is a bit heavier and the size they're almost the same so I, I don't care about the size anyways you won't be able to vape when the master switch is turned off it's just like a breaker at, at your house which is, uh, usually it can be uh, turned on and turned off and when it's turned off, you won't be able to use any of your appliances or any socket. And that's the purpose of the master switch. So, the best thing I like about the Hamog is you, won't, you don't have to worry about putting your PV inside your pocket or inside your bag and accidentally firing, it, firing the button because it won't work because of the master switch located at the bottom of the PV. Very neat. You won't be able to use your PV when it's turned off. So you have to press it once to use it. So here it is. I'm gonna make a, a long drug. Wow, that's huge. I'm gonna make a short drug to show you the vapor production. Whew, very neat. I like the vapor. It's, uh, it produces some more than my indulgence can produce. For me, huh? So it, it depends on how you vape it and how you use it. Another one. One long drug. The only problem I can think of is the size. It's not it's not pocket friendly anymore. <laughs> Maybe because of the C2R4. To so, you have to put it inside your bag or your pouch or just simply remove the 
cartomizer. So it's just it's almost the same as the indulgence. So that's it. I'm gonna I'm gonna make a follow-up review room note. Thank you.